What's up everyone, this is Big Chips Gaming and welcome finally to version 1.0. It is here, it is now. I'm so excited to play this. So much has changed. I would say like 99% of the game has been like touched on. Like some things have changed like per, uh, some like some things have been nerfed, bumped up, bumped down. Um, I, d I know a little bit of what's going on. I've like I have like checked some of the patch notes on what they've said. The main one being progression. And we're going to experience the progression, the changes and that as we get jump in. But I've started us here because I have um, I'm going to show you guys some stuff. I don't really show very often. I think it's important. This is a uh, so video this is my these are my settings vsync is on resolution field of view brightness i've turned it up by an extra 10 percent for you guys these are the quality everything set on ultra maximum power maximum gorgeousness and uh, ui haven't done anything really there and i've turned dyna dynamic mesh off off <laughs> mesh distance nothing even though i've done my because i've turned it off because this does hinder quite a lot of performance this is basically uh the player so me if i've done some destruction of a poi and you can see it in the distance or uh if i've built something so like a giant a giant house on top of a skyscraper in the distance you'd be able to see that if this was turned on but it's turned off but this does take a lot of uh, performance but we'll roll see how it goes for now um, let's go back and then go to oh yeah one of the main things is player profile so these are like the uh, the default kind of pro, uh, player profiles that you could play as I installed the uh, the brand new update last week um, and I like played a little bit in in this I made two characters I made a male and a female I don't know who we're gonna play I think it'd be uh, either either. Might go for the female. Why not? I usually do. It's just my my preference. Cool. Anyway, that is that. Let's go to new game. Now we want to set up our world. I do want to do random generation, new random world, and I want to make it huge, huge. I know there are mods that can go way above this world size 10,000 we've talked about that before the world side uh, one one block so the games are voxel based one block is one meter so 10,000 is uh, how much it is from the left like the bottom the bottom corner of the map to the top of a corner of the map opposite corners and then the uh, the blocks are measured diagonal so that's like 10,000 blocks world size 10,000 please World Seed, what should we call this? Shall we just call this one? Yeah, 1.0, why not? Premium quality. So there are some new things. There are some different things that are in this. The, the main one is that the burnt forest biome is now back in random generation, which is awesome. Uh, I think we want to go... I do like loads of towns. I'll set that to default. Rivers... I don't want to change much on this because I want to see the full experience of the brand new 1.0 because they've done a lot of different things. Lot they've changed a lot. So I think so. The wasteland is huge. That is a problem. <laughs> don't want the, I don't want it to be gigantic. Let's turn that up. Turn a couple of these things up. 17. 17. Yeah, that that's probably fine. Yeah, make, make make these a little bit bigger, but these are the, like the easy, easy starting biomes. These three: desert, burnt, pine. So we make them smaller than the others. Snow and wasteland are the two hardest. Wasteland being the hardest, we make that a little bit bigger. And uh, mountains, turn it down a little bit. Hills. Uh, yeah. Uh, the if. I've discovered as well that the more flat your world is, the the bigger chance I've had spawning giant cities. I do love me giant cities. Premium quality, hi. Okay, let's uh, generate the world. I've heard that this is really quick now, a lot quicker. It used to take my computer about five minutes to generate a world. Um, in case you guys didn't know, my graphics card is a 3080 Ti. 
So that kind of has like a factor. It's a pretty good graphics card. And uh, we're just going to see. Whilst we're waiting. So I've mentioned at the end of episode 3 of the joke mod. That I might not be doing many uploads for a while. Because of work. The work is a pr massive problem at the moment. <laughs> well, it, to, some, to uh, some aspect. I have to... After weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks of telling my bosses that I cannot stay away in hotels, can't do it, um, I finally caved. I finally caved. Had to. This week I've been working days and the driving backwards and forwards from where the job is to back home. It's a four hour round trip as well as working 10 hours on the shift. And we've, in the middle of the week, we had like some really crazy um, heat wave as well and we've been digging yeah it's uh physically doing it manual not with machines by hand horrible and it's m m my ass was being kicked definitely and it was just too much so i've caved so next week i'm going to be staying in a hotel and same as the week after so videos will be slowed down i mean it's my last upload was i believe monday i think it was a short last main episode series was oh hello no, that's pretty good oh i like that oh yeah look and the towns are generating oh that's cool that's cool that's quite a lot of towns in the wasteland three big cities by the looks of it oh i'm loving it i can't wait i can't wait oh this is huge this is default mostly i'm not to mod anything that's cool so yeah, videos will be slowed down just a little bit, and um, as soon I've only got two more weeks, two more weeks at this place of work, and then everything should hopefully be back to normal, and that should be fine. That should be good, and uh, well, um, and then we should be able to continue do a proper series again. Um, but we're just gonna play this on some days that I do have free, so I'm gonna I've got today free, tomorrow free. Um, I just it's just so you guys can see something because I know not everyone watches other youtubers there are some people that just stick to the one specific person that they watch and um, can I can I can I preview it oh wow I can move it okay how do I how do I go all right that is that's freaky well I feel we're just gonna jump straight in there's a lot of wilderness POIs as well. That's pretty cool. Alright, so... New game. Generation complete. Save radiation. Alright, I think it's just doing our last couple of things and it's going to start. Nice. So we're gonna, I'm going to try and just get some, some video hours, videos out as and when I can. Hopefully you guys can stay with me for the, for the ride. See how things go. Oh yeah, the main settings. So offline, don't um, I don't have any friends to play with. Happy days, miserable. <laughs> Difficult settings. I might stick it. I might keep it to Nomad. And sixty minutes daylight, eighteen min, eighteen minute hours. Blood moon. Uh, yeah, I'll keep it to ten. Everything else can stay the same creative mode is going to be on but that is to help me with making thumbnails so I can like detach my body uh, detach myself from my body and be a flying camera and take thumbnail pictures I do want yeah XP multiplier could be 150 so progression can be increased a tiny bit um, chunk persistent I don't know what that means what is that affects the amount of space reserved for saving saving explored chunks longer values allow more chunks to be saved before the oldest and the least important begin to reset while shorter values will cause chunks to reset sooner okay all right i'll just leave that as that for now so why is it say my game i've already named it i named it one one point zero thank you <laughs> anyway let's get starting They've still not changed the loading screen um, wallpapers. Still not changed that. I'm excited, guys. I'm excited. We're doing it. Seven Days to Die 1.0. We're going to experience it for the first time. I'm excited. I can't wait. 
ready to spawn in the world? I believe I am. This is new. Normally it would just start the world. Normally you don't get this option. Building environment. We're getting there. We are getting there. Can't wait. Oh. Right. So we're in. Oh, and it feels lovely. It does. I must say, it feels really smooth. No, I can feel feel a difference already. If you guys are curious, we'll turn the FPS on. We're at about 80, 70-ish FPS at the moment. But then again, we're not, we're not really near any towns or anything. All right, open challenge window. Tutorial challenge. Open the challenge window. Press Y. Okay. Oh, yeah. I've heard about this. This is brand new. So what we need to do, redeem the tutorial challenge. Okay, okay, redeem. Uh, nice, oh, we got some XP from that. Gather plant fibers, awesome. So, where's the journal? Oh, it turns on. Oh, so they've got rid of the journal. This is the new journal now. All right. That's pretty good because the journal was pointless. Absolute pointless. I never really used it. I suppose this is a real good system for um, new players. That's cool. Because, uh, yeah, if you're not used to the game, you're not going to know. All right, I've got a stump there. Oh, wow. They've even changed the cotton plants. Cotton plants look different. Oh, they actually look 3D. Loving it. Loving it. Oh, bird's nest. Nice, with some stuff. Loving it. Oh, POI over there. That's sick. That's cool. Might have to check that out. Right, what do we have? I, I still need... I still need plant fibers. Okay. Ugh, I'm, I'm bewildered. I'm flabbergasted. There is a lot of... A lot of things going on. A lot of change. Stone axe. Craft that. Oh, I saw that. Hold the stone axe. Okay. Oh, I'll have to point it out in a minute when it shows again. Stone axe harvesting. Harvest wood. Harvest small stone. And, oh. Okay, normally they crack open. Usually there's like three different boulders you have to go through till it's completely gone so it's literally just the one okay I like that hopefully it doesn't change too much on the harvest amount challenge stone axe harvesting is complete we'll just break this oh with a honey nice our first stump gave us a honey primitive outfit so yeah this is one of the big changes this is what I mean look there's like a high definition outline around the item I think that makes it easier to see because before there was issues. Primitive outfit. What do you do? Light armor rating. 8.1. Stamina. Nothing. Mobility. No All right. Okay. So it really is. I can modify, scrap, drop, wear. Wooden club. Craft that. Stick that down here. Oh, wow. I hear that. Oh, different. Different things. Have different sounds when you pick up and drop it down in your inventory. That is awesome. All right, primitive bow. Craft you. And then craft stone arrows, obviously. Uh, where can I... Oh, I've already got some in my inventory. I can make a whole two. Wow. Please be careful. I'll lock the arrows into my inventory. Love that they brought that out. I think it was Alpha 21. They brought out lockable inventory slots. Love it. So good. All right, open challenge window again. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is everything. Nice. So open you. 100 XPs. Yeah, this is everything we just done. Craft that outfit. Club. Arrows. Bows. And then the big rewards. Redeem basics of survival. Open that up. Oh, and now it's unlocked all of these. Build a land claim block. Nice. Good job, Survivor. You have proved to be capable capable with much potential. We have marked your map with the nearest White River outpost location. There will be yeah, there you will find a trader where you can buy and sell goods and trade stories with one of your friendly citizens. Welcome aboard, Noah. 
Awesome. Cool. Okay. Okay. So the trader, uh, it's about 800 meters away. Oh, that's so far away. <laughs> that's so far away. I might try and raid this place first. I uh, still can't pick up these lights. We'll turn them on. Irritating. I loved being able to pick those up. <laughs> okay, our first magazine is Rifle World. We can craft a quality two pipe rifle. Oh, we got a stone sledgehammer too. Do you know what? I've never actually really used the sledgehammers before. That might be something I might think about further on down the road. Possibly. So what's this POA? Navs gain. National Forest. Okay. Let's go in. Let's check it out. Hopefully it's not too dark. There are some lights. There's a little watering hole there. Oh, mushrooms. I'll take the mushrooms. Take all of that. Okay, is this a really big POI? It doesn't say what difficulty it is. doesn't even have a name just a rat yeah rotten cavern come on you're gonna get in there come on get in oh my buttons have changed crouch is is not it it, it it doesn't hold it I oh well I have to hold the button down oh well one and another big things that I was really looking forward to oh shit I'm stuck is the fact what's going on why am I teleporting backwards Oh shit, I should not be here. <laughs> Is he gonna crouch? Nope. Nice, we got him. Yeah, one of the big things that they showed. His zombie variation. That is awesome. Oh, water. Murky water, nice. So, do I go down here then? Right, okay. I apologize for the noise in the background, guys. Unfortunately, I do live in a city. There's always ambulances. There's always something going on. There's always construction. Oh, wow. Okay, I did not see you there. Kill Yo. Got to love killing Yo. Oh, stamina's a problem. Oh, loot bag. First loot drop. Stone shovel. There's some forged iron. Nice. Have I got? Have I still got? I think I might still have a loot abundance set to three hundred percent. Yeah, let's change that. Okay, it's not loot abundance. is at a hundred percent. Fair enough. All right, let's go back into the game. And we're back. Okay. Back in the cave. All oh, these little lanterns. I like those. Very atmospheric. This is really deep and really scary. And I kind of need to make a move to the trader. I probably shouldn't be here. This is really bad. It, it's mostly because the amount of loot that I'm getting in the in the in in just everything. <laughs> I'm trying to think of the word. Like trash trash piles and stuff like that is a bit. Uh, it's quite a lot. Shit! A zombie behind me. Oh wow, Steve with his what's that bowling T-shirt? Uh, we got you as well. Oh, two of them. Three of them. Uh, go away. Leave me alone. Stamina, come back, please. Oh, it's four of them now. Oh, I'm stunned. I'm stunned. Steve is moving very fast. Shit. Go away, Steve. <laughs> Four zombies. Should be doing it. Oh, nice. We killed them. Oh, yeah. There's new blood animation. Oh, I missed it. But I can hear it. That's cool. Oh, well. Okay. I will uh, take the body because I do need some bones. Can I make a bone knife, please? Bone knife. Thank you. Get that on the go. Um, put it there. I did take some damage, so... Yeah, she's used the bandage. Fair enough. That's fine. Munitions box, pretty good. With just ammo in it. Nah, not a lot. Not a lot going on. Oh, I will take that torch though. Yeah, I want to take all the torches. Torches are really good. 
really useful. Right, now let's find a way out of here. Whoa, okay. Crawler Boy and Joe just spawned in. Oh shit, I've not been in this area. Oh wow, okay. There's more stuff here. There's also a Natalie. A Natalie with like, what? Is that ducks on her t-shirt? And she's so grey. She really does blend into the environment. I mean, unless they're moving, don't really. I don't really see them. I really don't. Oh, Mega Crush. Mega Crush has had a make makeover. It looks uh, different. It's an actual energy can. Stats seem to look the same. Run speed. Love that. That's really good. That'd be good for Horde Knight. Mm, hopefully. Vehicle book. Check the rubbish. What else do we have? Nothing else. Okay, well, I think this place is done now. So let's, I don't know where the way out is. I have no idea. Oh yeah, I remember this this area. I think this is the way where we, fa no, we never went that way. We came from this way. We want to go backwards to where the light is. That's it. We want to climb up. Yeah, there's a hole right at the top. That'd be scary to fall in, fall down in. Is it this way? Yeah, follow the lights. Sweet, nice. Okay, so we're out. <laughs> we're out of here. Nice. Let's, uh, th all right, let's, let's th start heading to the trader. Time is getting on. Come across a businessman. Sporting a very nice brand new suit. Very nice. Thank you for that. We haven't gotten that far, but I've come across this area, and I'm wondering what it is. Can't really see. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, okay. That is brand new. Never seen that before. Like a lake with a bridge over it. With cars. Oh wow, that'd be cool. Imagine making b building bases in that. Skater boy. <laughs> Different coloured hood hoodie. Ow. I'm going to get hit quite a lot. Uh, stamina, if you could. Stamina. Stamina. If you could. Like, sort yourself out. Sort your shit out. Alright, do I have any skills? I have four skill points. Nice. Alright, strength. So, do I want to go... Yeah. Do I want to go into Skull Crusher or Pummel Peak? I think for now, Pummel Peak. Because Skull Crusher takes a crap ton of health. Not health. Stamina. So, we'll go into that. Um, and we'll go into... What is a good one? Parkour is a, a brilliant one. Bar a better barter, yep. And for the last one, I feel lock picking. Yeah, higher chance in finding Forge Ahead magazines in loot, and obviously we want to get a workbench on the craft as quickly as possible. Oh yeah, my um, come leaving leaving the world and come about got rid of the FBS counter. We got it back now. We're at. Why isn't that? Why is that weird? Why can't I see down there? Did I? Oh, I think I know why. Is it the dynamic meshes? Is that what's done that? I think so. Hang on, let me have a look. feel like I've fixed the problem now. Possibly, but I have lost a little bit on FPS. I'm going to have to turn it down. Let's turn it down. Options, video. Uh... 500 right okay so now there's buildings in front of us that was weird they should have spawned ages ago that might have been my fault all right we've got a little town little town nice little area we got a tumor over there different type of tumor brand new tumor oh and Arlene wearing a different dress different hair color I love it Zombie variation is sick. I'm not going to kill him because I'll be here forever. Why are you so shiny? I'm, I'm, in your colour, you look really gross. Fair enough. Okay. <laughs> yeah. So everything's spawning in for the first time. So it's going to have a little bit of performance. Hindrance, maybe. That's what, that's what it's pointing to anyway. Oh, we'll definitely eat you. 
a wiring book. Nice. I should be doing that. I should be looting some of these. Oh, do 20% more damage to land claim property. That is good for when we establish a home. We can put down a claim block. And if there's any modifications, changes, stuff like that we want to do, we can. Okay, so who's this? Army encampment over there. I don't like the fact that uh, it's wrecked. That trader wrecked is like on the outskirts. I don't like that of the town. I would prefer if he was right in the middle, because it means like it's gonna be a it's gonna be a mission to walk to like the furthest part of the town. Oh, the candies have gotten an, a, a makeover too. They look different. Okay, what do we have? Okay. Didn't we agree your first job was gonna be free? Damn, this is all I can spare. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got a stone shovel. Thank you, I guess. Oh, got any special jobs? Intro: buried supplies. Ah, so I what? So do I have to do this before? Oh, look who's tired of eating out of dumpsters and finally ready to do some work. <laughs> So I have to do this before I can start your well, mainstream quest. By the looks of it, you're gonna need it. Fine, take a fucking look. Jeez, Rex, wow. One of the things I saw in the patch notes is that traders have loads, loads more voice lines. So they say a lot more things. Um, not that I can really afford anything. Any oh, cooking pot. Do I have anything I can sell? Blood bag. Not really. I don't really have it. Oh. Make a crush sales for a good amount. That might be something I have to think about later. Loads of books. Can't get them any of them. We are very poor. Oh. Brand new armor. So lumberjack gloves. Axe melee damage. 2%. An extra 2. Preacher. Bartering when buying is at plus 2 biker outfit oh I can't wait these are gonna be these new I'm armor mods cheap armors clothes whatever they're gonna be cool very cool okay well we need to go and do our quest it's not that far away it's just out here kill businessman if you stop like flopping about Nice, it's just spawned in. Let's check it out. It's very small, which is happy days. Please don't take forever. It's going to take forever. I don't know if I like that. Intro, buried supplies. This is something I'm going to have to do every time I come across a new trader. And I, and I can only imagine that each trader have different, like, distance... I doubt it's always gonna. I doubt it's not always gonna be within a hundred meters away of their compound. Come on, berry supplies. Is that it? Yeah, it's there. <laughs> Nothing in it. Okay, and zombies do spawn. Fair enough. Kill you, Eileen. Great. Here you go. Don't spend it all in one place. Oh, okay, so we got a choice. Pipe machine gun, pipe baton, pistol, shotgun, rifle. I'm going to go with machine gun. Because I believe, I feel like it's just all round better as uh, the starting weapon, the primitive weapons. Okay, so now he wants to give us more, no, more no, like normal jobs. But they're also far away. Again, fetch... Look, Bob yeah, kid, the Jacobs support. residence. Don't just stand there with your thumb up your ass. Thank get you. Chop, chop, dumb fuck. <laughs> Did I get any money? I didn't get any money for that. You cheap son of a bitch. That's not a nice trader. Trader Rex. That's not nice. Uh, forge headbook. Yes, I can make a Jew collector now. Forge steel. Some other stuff. There is a cement mixer, and normally cement mixers are like a guaranteed. Oh, a primitive bow. 
Is it better? Nope. Yeah, usually it's a guarantee forger head magazine. Normally. I wonder if they've changed it. Uh, yeah, let's just open you. Okay, we did get some extra rounds. Let's chuck it down on our hotbar. Let's reload it. I love it. now you can, you can see the armor on my arms. That's cool. Before I never used to do that. Forge head, thank you. Nice to see that's still a thing. All right, let's uh, let's start going. All right, we're staying roughly in the town. Yeah, it's roughly about here. I am a little bit encumbered. Encumbered. I mean, not uncumbered. I'm gonna scrap the sled sledge. It's. Uh, I don't know how I feel. Uh, we'll, we'll experiment with the sledge maybe later on. We're no longer encumbered. Awesomeness. Let's go. Oh. Pistol. Actual money in there. Did they used to do that? I don't think they did. Normally it was like old cash. Oh, what? Really? Unless this, this is the one that I've already looted. Is this is that something we're gonna we're gonna start seeing? Letterboxes that have that you that are not always lootable. Oh man, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> That's annoying. If that is the case. It's relatively quiet. Compared to what we've had to go through with past series, like the Mega City series, Armageddon series, Forge Your Head. Lovely. I think one more, then I can make a forge. And then, and then obviously my 28 Alphas later series. This the spawn amount of wandering zombies in the area are crazy. Oh wow! Normally, that's that's changed. Normally, it used to be only the nursed uh, Natalie zombie. Oh hey 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 hey! Calm down! Don't be start running up at me. Don't be doing that, my friend. No thanks. You, you cut that out. Oh, painkillers, nice. And tech junkie, no thank you. And sharp sticks, no thank you. All right, well we we do need to loot some of these or all of these. Bows do ten percent more damage at night. Yeah, I'm gonna need that. Oh yeah, is this the POI that has the ammunition, the munitions box under it? Oh, it's. Does it? It still does. It still does. Oh. Oh, Buster Butt Breaker mod. Okay, well, we're going to put that into 20 more. 20% 20 against more stone. That is awesomeness. Also, the the look. I don't know what it is, but like. So the colours. The colours of the game when I'm walking around. When I move quickly, look different. A very good different, obviously, but still a little bit strange, that's all. I hope you guys know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but we will break these little uh, brick blocks, I think they are. Because they do give you the most amount of stone. There's a skater boy over there. Or oh, construction house POI. Nice. We need to hurry up and do this POI because it is getting closer to 6 p.m. And we do still need to establish a place to live. It, I might live here for a little while. Uh, the Honestly, the fact that I can't crouch toggle, I have to hold the key down, is annoying me. That's better. Nice. Now, when I crouch, I just have to press the key once, and that's it. Done. Right. Let's see what we got here. Nothing at the moment. It seems quiet. Check the shelves. I should really make a storage box. Yeah, let's make a storage box. Wood storage crate. It doesn't take nails anymore. Oh, these are the new writable storage chests. Oh, they look good. Oh, they look good. I'm not going to bother naming it. I'll keep the ammo on me, most definitely. And nothing else. No, we're fine there. 
There is a zombie that's angry. I think it's the zom uh, skater boy zombie. But we're going to get through all this, loot what we can. But we do need... It is a fetch, so we don't necessarily have to kill all the zombies. We just have to loot. All the time that they're stood like this, though, they have to be killed. And there's this actual... I could literally grab it and go. I want to, but I don't want to. Or book piles. Love it. Art of mining adds a small chance to mine rare gems from ore. And big hitters. Nice. Wooden club quality too. Ah, oh, just threw my wood in the bloody Oh in the chest. Oh we got... he's wearing a red one now. Oh, I do like it. I do like it a lot. And we took his... Oh, look at that. Nice. Lovely. Made him have a crater on his face. That is awesome. The Hunter's, the Hunter's Journal Volume 2. Do 10% more damage to wolves. Barbrawling. We're not using fists at the moment. We did try. We did try to do that in the last series. I'm still rather upset about that. Uh, yeah, let's make our quality two club. Nice. And let's scrap you. Put you down here. Throw everything in there. Cool. Let's carry on. Carry on indeed. Zombie woke up. Oh, it's the party girl. She's wearing a red dress now. Oh, I like that. I do like that. Is that a red dress or is it just covered in... Is it black or it's just covered in blood? Might be just covered in blood. Default classical mo. Just, uh... Stay the fuck down. Anyone in the bathroom? Or cabinet. Some aloe vera. Murky waters. Always need murky waters. Pipe. Yeah, uh, pipe, um, short iron pipes, I believe they repair your primitive weapons. So the primitive weapon being the pipe rifle. I mean, the name's in the bloody, the name's there. It's it, it's in the name. Did I loot the kitchen? I do need a cook, cooking pot. I need to be able to cook. I need to be able to make some dinner. Just open that up. Eat another way out. Another way in. Oh, Bernie boy. Sit you down. Oh, oh crap. Oh, that made me jump. That made me jump. <laughs> oh. He's got a hole right on the top of his skull. If you could all just stop breaking. <laughs> Let's get our bow out. And kill you. Is that all of them? Might be. Uh, still knuckle parts? No, thank you. Let's get in the shipping crate. See what we got. It's 7 o'clock. I may have to live here for the night. Possibly. Vehicle book. Main loot. What we got? Oh. Night vision. Huh. That is cool. I must admit that is really cool because you would never really find them. They were really difficult to look for. I think in all the times I've been playing Seven Days, I, that is like the one item I've rarely ever found. I think we found it in the Armageddon series, like late game near the end. Huh, nice. Ah. Can I make... Oh, primitive shoes. Okay, so wood and plant fibers. That might be something we could have a think about. Maybe something we could do. We've got a couple of a uh, couple of hours of daylight. I do need to get my wood, and I do need to get my plant fibers. They're over here. I, I have a hobbit. I have a hobbit. <laughs> I have a habit of collecting 
um, stone whenever I see it, especially early game. So that and where's my word? There it is. So gloves, yes. Hood, yes. Primitive shoes, yes. Nice, we had the perfect amount that we needed. Loving it. Let's chop this tree down. And after chopping that tree down, this stuff was done. So let's wear everything. Maybe I won't get hurt so much. Let's put the NVGs on. Oh my god, that's funny. I wish I could rotate the character. That'd be a nice little addition. I could put that on my face. Does it show? No, it don't show. Oh, well, okay. They've changed it. It used to be like a green. A green colour. Huh. Well, I've noticed that bit in inside buildings i know that the weather is quite nice outside and that does have like that does play a, f a part on the visibility inside buildings so if it's cloudy and it's raining it's very dark very yeah and then when you go inside a poi it, it, it's much more dark i do want to loot some of this i want that forge your head book I, I believe yeah there is nice I can now make a forge. Nice. Can I... Oh, I don't have a wrench to break that down. Okay, there are zombies here. Could you, like... Okay, he seems tougher. I feel like I should have killed him ages ago. What, Dar Darlene? I think her name is. What? S a screamer? No, 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 don't you dare scream. I don't know if you're going to spawn zombies or not. Actually, I'm, I'm curious. Scream. Are you not going to scream? It might be because she's a POI zombie. Okay. Well, that's cool. I do like that. I do feel like they should add demolishers to um, POIs on uh, POIs as well in quests. Oh, that'd be really cool. Add like an extra bit of risk, like have have one or two or something in like the main loot room on a tier five wastelands infestation uh, quest. That'd be amazing. I think that'd be really cool. So, you guys don't seem to die as quickly anymore. Normally, you would be done in like two hits. Pick up the stone. Oh, yes. Hangar magazine. Read that. Oh, there's more pallets. I'm definitely taking the pallets. Stone. Oh, wait. no. Wrong tool. This one. Thank you. We are just closing the doors behind us as we head on up for the night. And we're going to upgrade them. Make them a little bit more powerful. Can't do that anything with that one. This one is now locked open, which really infuriates me. Same as this one. I do feel like I need to take out the stairs. If I just stay quiet, I think I'll be okay. One would hope. All right, let's chuck. That's got loads of storage throw everything in there so this is that this is everything that we've gotten for today uh, barring the fact that I did throw quite a few stuff away like useless crap I want to I want to repair my axe please repair and I need wood repair start nice and fresh for the morning ah oh, crap these bloody holes oh, I don't even I don't have wood Shut that. It's not going to do anything, but I do want. Give me, give me, give me some wood. I want to make some frames. Some frames, please. Uh, let's go with ten for now. Nice. And these do seem like they craft faster. All right, where's that bloody hole? There it is. And then let's upgrade it. Yeah, that one was one as well. And then upgrade it. Nice. Uh, I'm going to stand. Oh, for fuck. 
Game. Me. It's my fault. I should be doing this. It's almost night time. What am I doing with my life? What am I doing with my life? I'm really hungry. But I don't have anything to eat now. These holes. These holes. These are not the holes that I want. I like me some holes. But not these ones. I need to get the hell up before the nighttime spawn start. If we stay crouched, we should be okay. Night vision goggles. Love it. That is pretty cool. <laughs> I wish oh, I wish it would be it would show like a glow on the zombies. I highlight them like a heat signature. I understand that's infrared. But infrared not infrared NVGs would be awesome. Please someone make that. <laughs> Please make that a mod. If it's not already a mod. Okay, well. Pretty good day. Pretty good day. This is the first day of version 1.0 experimental seven days to die so we're going to have this for like a month this experimental version and then stable should come out at the end of july so next month but i'm really enjoying it i'm really enjoying it i know slow progress is, ha is slowed down but we are yet to like see how how that's going to play a part i think they just like prolong the days so normally, when you're playing on your own, you'd like finish the game, you'd get everything important and powerful, say by, for me usually, like day 40. Day 40, between day 40 and 60 was kind of like the threshold of when you have everything that you want. But they, they've they extended that. I don't know how much further they've extended that. Um, so day 70 would be like when you have everything and then you you pretty much beat it in the game, but we, yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be good. I'm really loving it, enjoying it. But please take into consideration, guys. Videos won't be as consistent as they were, like normally once every two days, uh, with a short in between. Um, you guys know my current situation with work. These uh, uploads are gonna be as and when I can do them. Um, when I'm free, when I'm not working, when I'm at home, because um, it's, it's life, there's like other stuff, not just work, life stuff as well. I hope you guys can understand. I'm sure most of you will understand. But yeah, this has been 1.0. Big brand new update. The game is out of alpha. It's a bait, it's beta now. Can't wait, to, I can't wait for the future. Can't wait for it. But anyway, I'm going to leave this video here. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. If you liked it, please hit that like button. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to stay up to date for more uploads. And please subscribe. It helps the channel out bunches. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy gaming.